Good afternoon, Trojan TV News. I'm Marcus Cross. And I'm Rex Gonzalez. Well, Marcus, it's been a while since we've been able to anchor together since last year. Yes, I know. Let's hope it goes real smooth. No pressure. Just don't mess up. Anyways, NHS members are invited to an informational meeting next Tuesday, January 24th at 7.15 a.m. in room 112. Applications will be available and questions will be answered. Completed applications are due February 7th. Co-warming, dance guests, permission slips are available in attendance and reception. The form must be completed and submitted to the activity office by Wednesday, February 8th, before tickets are purchased. Guests must be enrolled in a high school and must be at least 15 years of age and less than 21 years of age. Tickets go on sale January 31st. Bring canned food to support the DECA 2012 food drive. Make sure you bring as much possible because the grade with the most cans at the end of the week will get to decide what section they will sit at during the quorming assembly. So bring your canned food to the candy shack next week and support your class. Once again, where will your can be? From dancing to learning about Denmark with Martin. Our foreign exchange student from Denmark will give a presentation on his country and his life back home on Tuesday, January 24th after school at 2.45 in room 326. Everyone is invited to come and show Martin our support. <laughs> Please come support the girls basketball team tomorrow at 3 p.m. for their third place game at the Baser Linwood Tournament against St. Joe Benton. Talking about basketball, our very own Danny Allen caught up with Kalisha West and a point guard for our Lady Trojans this year about playing Division I basketball. <laughs> Today I'm with Kylie Shaw West in the star point guard on this year's Lady Trojans basketball team. She was recently given the scholarship of the lifetime. She was given the full ride scholarship to CU on a basketball scholarship. Now first of all, congratulations on this award winning scholarship, but why Colorado? Um, the campus was beautiful. Um, the coaches, they all were family like. I got to meet the teammates on there. so. Um, you know, they're just like the people on the basketball team here. Um, and then just really the campus and what I want to do uh, is kinesiology and they had that and so that's probably why. So how is this season, your last season here at Park Hill, going to be different from all your previous seasons here? Um, I just really see no difference. Um, everybody's, you know, close. We're family. The coach has been the same. Um, we might play faster this year, and that's probably the only difference. But other than that, everything's just the same. So what can we expect from you and the other teammates this year while we're in the season getting going? Um, me, myself, I think I've stepped up as a leader um, already, and it's the beginning of the season, but I've stepped up, and a couple other people have stepped up. And you know, it's going to be a really good season. Everybody just needs to you know, stay positive and hopefully the people will come out and support us. And so, yeah. Well, thank you very much for seeing, seeing us today and we wish you luck next year at Colorado. Thank you. Well, after you get done playing basketball, you have to go outside. It's very cold outside. Yeah. Let's go over to Jordan Pulse and see how the weather's gonna be. Guys, it definitely is very, very cold outside. Right now, we only have a high of about 29. As you can see around the area, it's not gonna get too much warmer than a 29, 30 degree. Mark, uh, and it's only going to get colder this evening. As we move on tomorrow, though, it will warm up to about a high of 32. But do make sure you uh, get all warmed up and dressed up if you are going to go support the boys and girls at the Baser Tournament. Uh, Sunday, we'll have a high of 50 and a low of 37, but we do have a 30% chance of rain, so be prepared for that. And Monday, our day back, we will have a high of 36 and a low of 24. It'll be a beautiful Monday, still on that cold side. That's all I got for you today, though. Back to you guys. Thanks, Jordan. And soon of the day was Ian Lynn. Today's birthdays are Kelsey David, Devin Drury, Rebecca Gothier. And Saturday's birthdays are Brittany Allnett, Zach Anderson, Amanda Johnson, John Maydag, Kira Mason, Tatiana Murray, Hannah Smith, Cindy Thomas, Savannah Wisdom. And Sunday's birthdays are Sarah Bay, Elizabetta Korshuvanova, <laughs> Noah Madden, Aaron Mathis, Ashley Peterson, Josie Stevenson, Matt Gallen, Wilson Sanders. That's all for today. I'm Marcus Cross. And I'm Rick Gonzalez. Have a good weekend, Park Hill.